What's up, YouTube bland? Hey, how y'all doing? I'm back in the game with another video. Listen, I know y'all been wondering where I was at. I was in the upper room, dry humping. You know that thing good when, you know, about even a day after you're still in your sleep. You still dry hump. You know what I'm saying? Because that, that thing, yeah. Yeah. Had me clapping my, yeah. you know. I, I won't clap it. I won't clap it. Nothing. Don't get no ideas now. I don't play that. Don't don't get no ideas. I see y'all over there. You know what I'm saying? Trying to figure out what what's going on. You know, don't. I, I'm just joking. I ain't bashing my cheeks over here. All right. What's up, guys? I'm just coming in the game. Just full of life, inspired family coming. I'm cooking, doing a whole lot of gift giving. This is the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. Anyway, guys, I want to talk to you briefly about Travis Scott. Travis Scott, boy, come here. Come sit down right here. Come sit on my knee right now. Right now. I said right now. Come sit on my knee. I ain't going to do nothing to you. I ain't going to hit you, baby. Come on. Just sit on my knee. Sit on my knee. I just want to talk to you for just once. How dare you embarrass the African-American community by conforming to white privilege? You stupid little... You intelligent brother, you know better than to agree to do the Super Bowl. Kylie Jenner and her fake lips and her fake body and her billion dollar lip gloss or whatever it is has enough money to keep your behind out of the midst of this NFL protest that Colin Kaepernick started. Colin Kaepernick isn't even a full-fledged African-American and still, he stood up for us. You know what I'm saying? He came in the game. Control! He came in the game and said, I'm going to stand up for racial inequality in this country and police brutality. And you see how the NFL has done him and others that decided to kneel with this brother. And you're going to agree to perform with Maroon 5 in the Super Bowl? I try to say, that's one of those situations right there. One of those situations right there. You know what I'm saying? I, I play like it's all good. You know, you know, back in the days, you know, your mom, you get in trouble in school, they play like it's all good. And then when you get in the tub, they come in there and that belt, you know, that belt, and you in there, you know what I'm saying, you moving, you done left waves of water, you know what I'm saying, behind you, and you're overflowing the toilet, trying to get in a position to take them licks. Yeah, this is a situation where I would get Travis Scott in the tub. How dare you? It just makes us look, it just really makes us look bad. We are always, there's somebody in our community that always give white people the power they already have the power but they give them the incentive to keep oppressing us because we are always going to have one to two to three to four and it looks like many more than that to sit back and promote the ignorance that they continue to do to our race and they don't care about it because it's making them some money Travis Scott ought to be shame of him. If I could catch Travis Scott right now, I would kidnap him and get him in that bathtub and fill that water up and I'll get one of those. You know what? I'm not even going to get a belt. This warrants a switch. Go pick your own switch off that tree for actually agreeing to do the halftime Super Bowl. Boy, I tell you, I tell you, black folks, what... What, what what we gonna do? What we gonna do, black people? You know what I'm saying? We always have somebody. I hope he backs out. You better back out, boy. You hear me, boy? Donatello. Donatello, you Donatello. Donatello, looking boy. You better back out. And I'm dead serious. You better back out. Somebody need to put the pressure on him. In the hip hop community. Hey boy, you better back. Come here. Hey, say. Back out, boy. Don't do no stuff like that. Man, you make us look bad. 
Anyway, guys, drop down in the comments. Let me know what you think about Travis Scott. Is he wrong or not for actually performing during the halftime Super Bowl show that's coming up this February? Is is is, is he wrong or is he is it is it all good because he's going to go get that bag? Is all money good money? All money ain't good money. You know what I'm saying? All money is not good money. It's not good money. Sometimes you got to stand on the principle. It's principalities to this. You know what I'm saying? You got to stand on the belief system, the morals and the values that your mother, that your father, your grandmother, your grandfather instilled in you. I'm trying to tell you, you know, straight up, I done went from a switch. No, check this out. I done went from a belt to a switch. You know, Travis Scott need an old nasty paddling. You know, them, 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 them paddlings we used to get in school. He need an old nasty paddling for actually agreeing to do this. Agreeing to do this. Somebody need to stop him in his tracks. Stop him in his tracks. Don't embarrass yourself like that. Don't embarrass the black community like that. Because when you conform to keep to to, to to the wishes of white supremacy, they can look at and use Travis Scott as an example and say, well, hey, not all black people feel that way. So, you know, every time you got to think about what you're doing before you do it, because every time you do something like that, you just give them the... Uh, the mindset to say, well, you know, not all of y'all feel like this. There's still some over here. You see these bulk dancing. You see them over here doing the butterfly to white supremacy. They love us. We the one that write the checks. So there's a certain amount of y'all that's going to conform to our wishes. That's what white people, some white people think about us. We got to do better. We got to do better. All right, drop down in the comments and get your eagle on. Even if you got, even if you ashy or even if you got on your grandmama thong, just drop down and get your eagle on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me know what you feel about this situation. Let me know if Travis Scott right or wrong. It's all good. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. Have a great day and I'll see you later, all right?